Hello, and welcome to Flashback Star Wars Obsessed. We're in 1982 with the release of the Tripod Laser Cannon. Manufactured by Blast Tech Industries, the Tripod Laser Cannon, known as the E-Web Heavy Repeating Blaster, is one of the most powerful repeating blasters in the galaxy. A portable weapon that can be disassembled into disparate parts and reassembled in no time on the field. After setup, optimally the weapon requires two troopers for use, one maintaining the cannon, the other adjusting and monitoring the XON class 4T3 power generator, which can be pre-charged as witnessed in The Empire Strikes Back. With myriad parts combined to form this well-designed accessory, in The Empire Strikes Back, viewers witness a squad of stormtroopers setting up a tripod laser cannon in order to fire upon the rebels during the Battle of Hoth. Even the cannon Cannon's hose and power unit are visible. The E-Web is a favorite weapon of the Empire, sporting a laser actuator, three Blastec TR-62 auto cushion tripods, a flashback suppressor, an energizer hose, a binocular setting, and a sight with infrared adapter and a carry handle to add to the weapon's portability. The Kenner tripod laser cannon clicks when moved side to side and moves up and down to destroy its targets. While its energizer pack and hose are removable in order that you may utilize tripods to open and close to set up your attack bases. It is popular among collectors particularly since the cannon's power hose can be fully stored inside the power unit when not in use. First issued in 1982 along with the Vehicle Maintenance Energizer and Radar Laser Cannon, the Tripod Laser Cannon survived on shelves all the way through 1984. Its popularity was surely due to its cool design, as well as to the fact that it actually played a prominent part in The Empire Strikes Back. It came with a few components, including a hose and an energizer box. Although the original Empire Strikes Back issue of the item isn't incredibly common in unused condition, the later Return of the Jedi version is probably most common. Cases full of unopened examples still exist, a fact which means that sealed tripod laser cannons are pretty easy to come by. And here it is, the tripod laser cannon from Kenner. Vintage gold. All the parts are here. This part of the uh, hose connects to this power generator. And this part of the hose connects here. And, and then it has a connector here that it connects like there. And then here are the legs. The legs move up and down. And what's interesting is that it can Go like this side to side, and when you turn, there's a clicking noise. It's Kenner Magic, indeed. The clicking. It wouldn't be Kenner if it didn't have the clicking. And it moves up and it moves down. Like that. It's really nice detail on this thing. But you can take this off. Yeah, the can can be disassembled. The legs can come off. All these parts come, come off, just like this. It is so cool. And I've had this since back in the day when it was released in 1982. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and click subscribe. You can check out other flashback videos here and here. You can follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Thank you for watching Flashback Star Wars Obsessed.